G'day there, uh, thanks for stopping by. Thought I'd share with uh, you guys something I've noticed about uh, glass gates and uh, with my uh, dust collection system I've gone to a fair bit of trouble to try and ensure that I have continuity uh, in the pipe side, especially inside diameter from the uh, cyclone to whatever piece of equipment it is, you know, uh, table saw, you know, joint fix or whatever. Uh, have nice uh, you know, soft bends, not sharp 90s as much as possible. All helps obviously with uh, good airflow, which then results in uh, you know, good extraction at the, uh, the dust source. Uh, got two glass goats here. Uh, this one, this is a four inch or 100 mil. I've had that one for about 20 years. That came from a company called Carbotec in uh, Australia. And uh, this one is a, a five inch or 125 mil. Uh, I bought this last week from a company called Timbercon. Uh, both say that they're made in Taiwan, uh, but they're both slightly different a little bit. And uh, what I did discover when I was uh, just having a look at this one, uh, when it's fully open, uh, this sliding plate that obviously closes it off uh, still blocks the uh, inside diameter. So it's giving you some risk. Well, giving me, it will give me some restriction. Um, obviously it's um, going to slow the system down somewhat, a little bit, maybe not, maybe you know, to the extent that I wouldn't even notice, um, but every little bit helps. Um, so I think that uh, I need to do something about that. Um, what it is, uh, bring it over. If you haven't seen these before, they've got a lug on them in the centre here, I don't, hopefully you can see that. Uh, obviously stops you from pulling the, the cover plate completely right out of out of the unit. Uh, my intention will be to grind that off completely with the Dremel and then from uh, this point up here across the actual gate part itself be riveting on up the top here away from the sliding mechanism a little bit of chain so I can't pull it right out. Uh, the four inch one Pretty much the same, but a little bit shaped, shaped a bit different um, in the actual plate itself. Uh, still has only half a radius lug on it. Um, but once again, when that one's opened, still a little bit of restriction there. And I, would it make big, much, much difference? Maybe not. But as I said, uh, I believe every little bit helps. Uh, obviously what I'm going to do is not going to hinder it. If anything, it will uh, improve it. Um, not that the uh, blast cake companies are going to listen to anything that I say, but uh, if I was uh, designing one of these things, um, I'd get rid of the lug from there, put a half radius lug on the end of this uh, plate, and then in both sides of the main body, have an indentation where that lug would go, so that you get full closure, and you get it to fully open, in the open position. They're obviously not going to listen to me, and uh, that would be probably a fair, fairly major exercise for them for redoing their moulds or whatever they do. Um, yeah, so I'll get into grinding her off and um, setting up the way I like. Okay, all done. Uh, the 100 mil one back up on the overhead. Looks fine. Five inch one here. Uh, go back in the bottom of the table saw. As you can see, I have a now. The plate's right out of the way. So I'm uh, happy with that. That'll help me a little bit. I uh, suppose a couple of tips if you think that your, your own system's you know, down a little bit on what it originally was, check your needle felt bad, completed filter, um, you know, you need obviously good airflow from the point where you're collecting the sawdust and it also needs to exhaust out into something wherever you're, you're doing that, it means a clear path, unrestricted, so if your needle felt bad, it's chock a block, uh, you're going to find you're going to have, you know, bugger all uh, airflow down at this end. Uh, my situation, I'm lucky, I've been able to vent externally, which I've shown in other videos, um, so I have good flow from here and good exhaust flow. 
the secret, one of the secrets to uh, good uh, dust collection. Uh, hope you found it uh, beneficial, and uh, thanks for watching. Till next time, take care. Uru.